Hello everyone, and welcome to my in-progress block mesh level. I will be show walking through the optional pass through my level and kind of showing what I'm working on. So at the beginning of the level, the player starts off in this prison cell. Uh, I don't have any doors in yet. As they look around, there's a few places they can go. Over here to the left is just a little guard room. In the final version, or the take it to the next level version, there will be a collectible in this room. Uh, continuing this way, we come down into a torture chamber, which this area still needs to be filled out. Uh, there will be another collectible here. And then over here into uh, this big storage area, which at this point the player will have the player mechanic, which will allow them to use telekinesis to toss and throw objects. This will kind of be the area where they get to practice that. Uh, this will be the first uh, path, so as we go up here, find a path here, and I kind of have my the player character walking kind of slow right now, just to help me walk through the level. Uh, as they come in here, they can find the library, which I want to change up the lighting just because I uh, wanted to give it a more mysterious air. Um, this is where the player character will receive the quest to collect the books throughout the castle, and then bring it back here and stock them into the their appropriate shelves. Right, as we continue, we'll go back to our original path. Come up this way. And through here, they will find the Grand Hall, which is in a state of disrepair. And this will be the exit out to the front gates, which the player would think it would be escape, but the bridge would be the bridge is broken. And falling here would be another optional side objective. Uh, I'm still working on this progress and going to connect a uh, bridge later on, showing like where it would have connected. Turning around, kind of get a look at the castle. And we'll just go back to our path. As you can see, there's other ways out of this room, which we'll explore later. Coming up here, we have, this will be the throne room with the statue puzzle, pushing and pulling, physically pushing and pulling. And as the player character sends these stairs. This is how they will reach the top of the level and the level end. And this, these areas just all connect. This is the three connections from the, the alternate routes onto this final area. Uh, okay, and coming down this way, this will lead us back into the throne room. And this turret here is just, this connects just the throne room up to the top of the castle. Uh, coming through this way, this is the area where I'm trying to figure out lighting. Um, just a nice tight corridor so lighting doesn't really spread here. But this would be the primary path. Um, this leads to all floors, connects every floor to each other. Um, so we're just at the throne room, connects down here to the grand hall. Coming down further. The player will find access to the library. And if we continue descending, we will get back to the starting area, which is the prison. Um, and then for the third optional path is I kind of wanted to play with um, like danger and I will implement a climbing mechanic and this will lead into a hole into the library and I kind of want to do this for the rest of the floors is have these paths where the player character can jump around and blow holes out in the wall, which allow them to a different way of traversing the level and reaching the roof of the castle. 
Um, like I said, this is still in progress. There are areas that are not complete, and I'm still trying to figure out lighting and things like that. But this is my current level block mesh. Any and all feedback is always appreciated. And thank you for watching.